Hey y'all, welcome into the channel. I hope that everybody is having an amazing day. So, what I saw in the meditation, it's going to be your sidebar LOL. You guys, thank you so much. Before I get started, thank you <laughs> for coming in. Thank you for joining. Thank you for returning. Thank you for showing your girl all the love and support that you guys show the channel. I really appreciate it. Okay, you guys, we are slowly but steady growing. And I'm very proud of... Um, our growth. I feel like we are, we are solid. Okay. Like the weight that we have on this channel is solid weight. Okay. Um, so thank you. Thank you. If you are subscribed, thank you. If you, um, you know, have supported in any way, dropping your likes, commenting to the channel, commenting to me. Thank you so much. You guys, I really do appreciate every single one of your comments. Um, let me get to the message now. For your sidebar, LOL, I decided to do each zodiac their own. And in this case, um, I saw in meditation that there was some spiritual court, okay? Spiritual court, sidebar, LOL, spiritual court was going on, okay? And um, judgment's been called on some energies. At first, I thought it was one person in my vision, and then I saw that it was a multiple uh, it was a, a group. It was multiple people. I don't know why I wanted to say a multitude of people, but it was multiple people that were being judged for their discrimination against you um, and their crimes, their acts, their crimes against you. Okay. So in this spiritual court session, um, I saw a whole laundry list of things that had been done to you in the spirit be brought up okay and brought forth to the court so let's see what this sidebar lol has in store for you spiritual court all right let's happy happy okay here we are the number eight is significant okay um, eight speaks about movement travel abundance your birthday could be in august you could be a leo if you are happy birthday leo okay or if you're just a leo and you're not this sign whatever sign is going to come out at the end but no matter if you're in here and you're resonating um you know and you're a leo happy birthday okay so happy happy okay so it looks like the court case for you is gonna go very well okay um spiritual court for you goes better than expected Ooh, something's hand selected for you okay hand selected check out that reading okay it's another sidebar lol and it's titled hand selected okay so anyway it's like things are gonna go just how god intends for them to go for you in this spiritual court setting okay spiritual court sidebar lol what am i going to need to hear and see we have here and now happy happy here and now okay it's like your happiness is here it's up for grabs okay good news is here it's up for grabs here and now okay are you ready to build upon it i feel like are you ready to expand upon your happiness Okay, there's someone that could be coming towards you like, hey, I want to invest in you. Hey, I, I have an opportunity for you. Hey, I figured you'd be a good fit for this. Hey, would you like to try this? Hey, would you like to join this team? Would you like to be a part of this group? Would you like to try this out? Um, for some, you could be being called to be a, what is the word? When they, people, they sell a product and they're looking for people to represent their brand, someone could call you like, hey, I think you'd be a great match to wear this item, to fit this, to whatever. Okay, we got chop wood. The number six is here. Somebody's birthday could be February 6th or May 6th, March 2nd or April 2nd. There could be an Aquarius significant. At the bottom of the deck, okay, we have thinker. I feel like somebody thought they had it in the bag. They thought like, Psh, I'm going to do this. And then this right here is going to happen. And I feel like the need to tell you it all backfired. Go watch that reading. 
I feel like somebody thought they had it all figured out. They thought that, hey, I could do this. I could pull the wool here. I can pull a trick here. I can do this right here. And then voila, magic. Nobody would know it was me, right? And I feel like it all backfired with chop wood. It all came to an end. It all fell apart. This person that was thinking this, they're now sitting and they're having to sit with some sort of notion, the conclusion, the conclusion of this spiritual court setting. Happy, happy spiritual court chop wood. It's over. Whatever that this laundry list had to do with of the offenses that were made against you, it's over with. It's been shut down. There could be a business that's getting shut down. Uh, but there's something here that's being shut down, some type of organization, okay? We have the Queen of Pentacles. This is someone who is secure on their own, grounded, stable. Yeah, look, four of wands, grounded and stable, secure. A Sagittarius could be significant. There is an S here, it, or it could be a Scorpio. What other zodiac begins with an S? I think that's it. Sag and Scorpio. Someone's position is being solidified. Okay. They're having to honor some type of documents here, okay? These documents have to be honored or it has to do with ranking, spiritual ranking that's being honored within the courts. Judgment, okay? Judgment energy in the air. We have the Three of Swords. Yeah, they're having to honor this because with the Three of Swords, they tried to hurt the wrong person. They tried to hurt somebody who was high ranking. Six of Wands, you're receiving a victory in court. Page of Wands, you're going to receive communication about this unexpected victory. The people who hurt you, they didn't expect this. They didn't expect, like I, I said, I feel like they, they thought they could do this and do that behind the scenes and they wouldn't get caught and everything would, would look, make it look like it was all your fault. But with the Knight of Cups, I feel like they're sorry. Like they're like, ooh, someone, it's not remorse. It's just like, because... I feel like they're only sorry because they got caught, but I feel like they, they, they're like, they're sorry in a sense of, you know how you'd be like, you'll be sorry if you do that. It's like that type of vibe. They're sorry. They got some news they didn't want to hear. Okay. Something about somebody's eye. Somebody could have a black eye. We have the hair font here. It's like when they went to spiritual court and this laundry list of things that they had done to you got brought in front of the court. God, here's the judge. Here's God. Here's that energy. God is like, y'all did all of this to harm this person who's a high ranking official or a high ranking person, a member of the court themselves, an earth angel. This could actually be law enforcement, like someone who works for the court or the, the law, the justice system. But I'm talking spiritual court. So it's like somebody tried to come up against a member of the court or someone who was high ranking in the spiritual community. God ruled on this. God says, God warned them that they would be sorry if they did this. They did it anyway. They're in regret. I told you they'd be sorry. Nine of Swords is here. You're receiving some type of abundance. Maybe just news that this is over with or that this is, this is, yeah, Nine of Swords. They're in regret for this trauma they caused you. They got some bad news here. This backfired. The Magician. Okay. I told you. This thinker, they thought their magic was would overpower you. Or they thought that with their magic, they could get away with something. They thought wrong. They're in regret now. Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo could be significant. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio could be significant. Aries, Leo, Sag. 
force energy is here as well. Somebody was thinking they could something about a Gemini. Maybe this person, they're a lover or they did magic on your lover. Whoever this is, they took you for granted. Abundance is now on the table for you. But I feel like they thought that they could do this to you and get away with it. And I feel like God is declaring otherwise. Spiritual court. Sidebar, LOL. Spiritual court. Did they forget about spiritual court? Did they forget? Maybe they didn't expect for you to call judgment. They didn't expect for you to take it to the court. Forgiveness is needed. These people could ask for your forgiveness now. All bark and no bite. They see that they were ineffective. They may have like been the loudest in the room or kept up a lot of noise or made a lot of noise or disturbed the peace in some type of way. But they were ineffective. They could have been an awesome magician, an awesome sorcerer, but God is the real sorcerer. They came up against somebody who was high ranking. You could be a high ranking uh, magician of the light, liquid gold energy which overpowers any type of magic because magic is false. It's fake. It's a trick. Yours is not a trick. What you do for God or in the light, it's priceless. Looks like you won this case. This has been your read. Let's find out who you are before we wrap this up. here you're gonna know this is your read you've gotten a, a victory at work someone's gonna come and apologize to you you could be a mother cactus is significant you could see a lot of cactus cactus talks about it's the cactus is represented by something that can survive in any terrain you're strong there's a, a, a unique strength about you Unique power within you. Someone was using the cycles of the moon to harm you, to harm your stability. They regret it. It's backfired. Spiritual court. Scorpio, something about a Scorpio could be significant. I've already done Scorpio's read. Something about a Pisces could be significant. I've also already done Pisces. We have Sagittarius. Now, I have recorded Sagittarius, although I don't know I'm, if I'm going to post it. So if I don't make this be Sagittarius, if I leave the current Sagittarius reading I have, then this will be Gemini. Okay, so I'm going to post this for now as Gemini's read, but I might change my mind. This might be Gemini slash Sagittarius. Um, either way, I hope you enjoyed and I will catch you guys next time. Bye.